Hi everyone, welcome. It's me, Lori, from Inner Goddess Tarot. So this message is mainly going out to my Toronto friends because I'm really excited to be announcing a series of workshops that I'm doing at the beautiful oasis of Wonderworks here in Toronto. So coming up in October, November, December, I'm offering a tarot workshop each month. And these workshops are geared at people who have at least a beginner knowledge of tarot. So beginner is fine, just so you have a familiarity with the cards because uh, the material that we're going to be diving into goes beyond just the basics. So upcoming workshops at Wonderworks. So my first workshop is on Tuesday, October 27th at 6 p.m. It's called Halloween, a time for divination and tarot. And what a beautiful time to consult the cards. At this time of year, the veil between the worlds is at its thinnest. There's a feeling of sliding into the winter, sliding into that time of quiet reflection. So to me, this time of year feels already very much like New Year. So it's a great time to consult the cards, to think about what do I want to keep from this past year? What do I want to let go? Uh, what are my hopes and aspirations going into the winter, into the new year? So this will be a really fun and also useful workshop because we'll look at a specifically Halloween themed spread, but also talk about ways to tackle a spread, strategies for when you um, are starting to get comfortable with larger spreads beyond the three card one. So. My second workshop is November 3rd, also at 6 o'clock. It's called Clothing, Color, and Body Language in Tarot. So this is a really useful workshop where we will look at the imagery on the cards in a different way. So, I mean, you know, the tarot is so rich with symbolism, right? Some of those symbols just yell out at you. You can't ignore them. They're just so um, clear and right there, easy to see. But some of the symbolism is a little bit more subtle. So we'll take a look at how uh, color is used in the tarot, the background color as well as colors of clothing and that kind of thing. Also we'll look more specifically at clothing. So what does it mean in when the figures that appear in the cards are dressed in a certain way because that can give you some information about the role that you play in a situation or the appropriate role to play that kind of thing and also body language so I find this is really useful in spreads as well um, are the figures in the cards facing each other? Are they reaching out to you? Are they closed off? These clues give us a lot of really deep information into the interpretation of our cards. And finally, on December 8th, what will 2016 bring? Exploring your 2016 Tarot Year card. So wow, this is a really powerful workshop where we'll take a look at, first of all, the specific card for you that represents your 2016 what this means about the energy that's around you, the resources, the challenges, and how to um, tackle what lies ahead with grace and flow. So we'll take a look at your your personal year card uh, as well as doing a spread to explore um, how to manifest the most out of 2016 and we'll also take a look at what's going on universally in 2016. So your own personal card as well as the universal card for 2016. So I encourage you to visit my website, innergoddesstarot.com. You can register for the workshops there. And if you register for all three, then you will enjoy a special discount package price. So thanks for listening. I'm really excited, as you can tell, to be offering these workshops. They're going to be fun. They're going to be useful. They're going to be a nice combination of um, educational material as well as hands-on experience. So it's going to be great. Please sign up today. InnerGoddessTarot.com. Thanks. Bye.